Hello everybody and welcome back. Rod here with some more Tomb Raider for you. On the last one we uh, took care of these guys back here. Didn't do a very good job but we managed to take care of them. Um, and it looks like she's still kind of uh, in ready to fight mode so I'm assuming Trinity is still around the corner. Oh, what's this? The younger Croft is more active and less cerebral than her father was. <laughs> Although intelligent, she is less focused on the meaning and history of the artifacts she seeks and more prone to risk taking. With no children or family of her own, she is free to pursue her targets, almost to the point of obsession. Although this can make her appear impulsive or unpredictable at times, we believe her drive and the balance of her personality will make her easier to influence with the promise of greater challenge and more likely to deliver results. Any information she might have that Richard Croft withheld from Trinity would simply be a bonus. We recommend her as a strong target for recruiting. Yeah, she didn't sound like she was that much of a fan to read that. Alright, let's do this. Okay, so... I hear somebody. Press square to cover Laura and Lud. Okay. Mud camouflage. Alright. There we go. I was like, I know some of this stuff is collectible stuff we want to <clears throat> use for crafting. I thought one of them was like to knock over. I'm like, no, I'm not trying to be loud. I'm trying to be sneaky, I thought. There, all access points are covered, and most of the oh, this guy's done for. Almost isn't good enough. Secure the perimeter. I now. need the dude in the back to turn around. Tight. Aye, sir. Uh, if I could ask, sir, uh, what's going on? Got him. Recon team is on route. Work out. Is there any indication what might be happening yeah. when we lost contact? Is it just those two? I feel like there's another one if I go sneak up on him. Lazy shit. Oh shit. Now I have to do everything. Gotta find out what the hell's going on. You're not gonna. <sighs> oh yeah. Being sneaky is the best, you guys. Oh, got one more down there. Two more. Okay. I saw, yeah, I was like, I saw another path over here. Oh, shazer. Many structures in here. The sight lines are shit. Shouldn't we send someone down to look for them? Would have said he was leaving. Need some backup here. I'm trying. To <laughs> I don't want him to see me, but <laughs> like, what do I do? Oh, what? Why though? Why'd they just get nervous all of a sudden? I wasn't even doing anything. Gotta check that. Yeah, go check it out, Keep man. A of yards of each oh other. man. Yep. I'll say I gotta at least take care of one of them. Oh, right in the neck. Oops. <laughs> Try to hit square, I hit triangle, and I just straight up. Punch the air. Okay. So now we can just continue on then. I don't really see anything else that's collectible wise. Okay, the perimeter's locked down. All we have to do is wait for the recon team. Doesn't it seem a little weird to you? It was oh boy. 
Let's see if we can. No, they didn't get his attention. I don't know, man. Still feels like we went from an amber alert in the known area to a red alert all over the place. We've been overreacting to things ever since that storm hit. Hmm. I worry they'll see me, but if I do this. I switch shoulders? Yeah. Hey, you should go check it out. God damn it, she's hunting us! Fucking bastards! What? What makes you say that? I would never hunt you guys. Oh. <laughs> Headshot, 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 headshot. Beep, beep, beep. Hey, and I got a trophy for it. <laughs> nice. Jonah, Commander Walk is here in Peru. He ordered Trinity to lock down a dig site below an old oil well. You going to check it out? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. I'll see what they found. Walk was there in Cozumel when Dominguez took the dagger. They must have figured out the next step to the hidden city. We got to mm, beat him. Impossible. I can't carry any more. Oh, well, I didn't realize it said full, Lara. Give me a break. Break me off a piece of that, uh, Kit Kat bar. Can we jump up here? <clears throat> One thing I like, too, um, is they always have, like, you know, how I went about it is just how I felt like going about it. There's so many more ways you can go to take out the enemies, and it's just really neat that they put that process in there. I prefer to be sneaky. Like I just did, like that's the best way for me to do it, just because like, you know, it's much easier to get owned once they start shooting bullets. Yeah. And I try to make it so they don't know where I'm at. Alright, so we're going to investigate the oil well. Okay, we need to jump over there. Yeah, yeah. And then you <clears throat> press L2, and then you go down. I thought you hold it down. That's why I kept messing it up the first couple times that I was doing this. Alright, exploring the excavation. There's been a bloodbath here. What well, of happened? course. If Trinity's involved, you know there's gonna be a bloodbath to soon follow. Uh Okay, I was like, I thought I saw something gold. What's this? Attention, Dr. Dominguez. Possible entry point located for temple outside of Kwakyaku. Excavation equipment en route. Okay, wow, that's very useful information. I'm already in here, I can see all that. <laughs> What's this one? Oh, did I just get a map? Hell yeah. I get whatever this item is? Yeah. Alright. Well, we should probably be a little quiet, but we're just gonna wait, 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 wait. This just looks dangerous. I feel like something bad's gonna happen. I mean, obviously the bodies have been a clue, but... What the hell? Oh, he was impaled. I thought he was holding a gun. Like he was shooting at something. I was like, damn, he like was like frozen. I don't think I can walk across that can I just jump over it? Yeah. I don't know why I didn't think to just jump over it. Oh, we're working on the second tier, eh? So it seems like there's a few tiers to each language that you learn. Yeah, like that legit looks like he's holding a gun. Like, just for a quick glance. <laughs> oh, whoa, hey. Okay. Jonah, I made it inside the temple. I think we found something here, too. Some numbers. I'm gonna clear it off. Oh, boy. This is creepy. I don't know what we're gonna find in here. Straight up fire. Well, that's not good. We can't go down there, obviously. Have to match the symbols. Find a way to open the gate. Uh, what do you mean match the symbols? To what? Like the numbers on the pillars look like the first half of dates. Ishal on the left, Shakshal on the right. 
Oh, they didn't tell us any numbers yet, though, did they? Oh wait, they have to match, like, on the bottom and the top, okay. Uh, I think I'm doing this right, I don't know. door or something? Oh shit, I just jumped down there? That's cool. Oh, there's snakes and shit. <laughs> I thought like that you could just jump down there and that was a path that opened. Oh man. <laughs> well you guys, don't do that. Don't, don't pull at me. So I assume this is supposed to open then maybe. I legit thought you'd go down there because I just saw, you know, I'm, oh, okay, now I see the snakes. Okay, yeah, I couldn't see them because it was like, it was so shiny like that. Silly. The numbers on the pillars look like the first half of dates. Ishal on the left, Shakshal on the right. What the hell? Okay. that do? Can I go in there? Whoa. That's pretty cool. Oh, uh, what the hell is this? Am I supposed to, like, do something with that. Alright, let's go back this way. <clears throat> Check the other side. Dun, 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 dun. Alright, what's this one I have to provide for us? Okay, so it looks like I need a three and uh, whatever the hell that symbol is. Oh, there's three of them now. Okay. Okay. So, four solid three. This way? Yeah. And then, what was the other one? It was three, and then the thingy, and the thingy, okay. I don't know, like a hockey puck? Is that what that is? <laughs> okay, that didn't do anything. We haven't unlocked a fourth one yet. Is that what this is? Aha. I swear if that ground falls, I'm gonna freak out. Another door. There must be more to this. I don't know what Damn, I'm doing. I should have known. Oh no. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Let's shut it up. I knew it. Oh, hey, there's a fourth one now. Okay, okay, okay. So we open that, and then it's another hockey puck, and then a straight line. And then straight line, okay. Alright. That's good to me. See what happens. Yeah. Hey, Jonah, oh, just... any progress? Uh, there's an incomplete date and a depiction of Shuck Shell. I have two dates here. 
and Isho. Yeah, I think I've seen the date on the left somewhere. Oh no, I'm dead. Damn it. I thought that was it. <laughs> uh, I thought that was it because she was talking to Jonah, so I was like, oh, sweet. Okay. Well then. Hey, Jonah, any progress? Let's try that again. Uh, there's an incomplete date and a depiction of Shuck Shell. I have two dates here and E Shell. I think I've seen the date on the left somewhere. The photo from Cozumel. Maybe there's a clue. Okay, Jonah. What's the final number for Shack Shell? A line across with two dots on top of it. Seven, I think. Thanks. Uh. Damn. Alright, well, it made a noise. That must mean something. So, wait, is that right, though? The one on the left? She said there was a photo I could look at? I do not know what she's talking about. To this find one? the hidden city. Go south along the shore. No, I don't think that's it. This is the star Alfad, the solar. In the Maya long count calendar, all dates have five numbers. This new one was damaged to look like a thirteen. But what if it's really an eight? That's what a two it? thousand year difference, and the constellations would be in a completely different position. So the star path. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. So this is it. In Peru. So three with a line underneath of it. Aha! There we go, you guys. I figured it out. Bam. Okay, so that should be it then. I think we got it. We'll see when the ground starts. Damn, I should have known. No, run, 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 run. Ah. So what did I mess up then? Because it's what? Three, three hockey pucks, and then another three, because she said the left filler. And then four, one, three. Hmm. it would be because that's definitely what the picture had right oops in the Maya long count calendar all dates have five numbers this new one was damaged to look like a 13 okay but if it's really an eight that's a 2,000 year the last number on the left pillar is zero different position so the star path would lead west to somewhere in Peru. So wait, I don't know what the hell zero is though. I thought it was this the uh, picture. Okay, so that's what he said. So what's zero then? I mean that's definitely not zero. Is it legit just that all the way down? Hmm. Oh, hey, that's it. All right. All right. Hey. That's it. Okay, I just misunderstood. I thought I remember seeing the hockey puck there, so I was like, I think it's kind of ready to go. Okay. Alright, sorry that took so long, guys. <laughs> Let's go ahead and see what this one is. <clears throat> Just a little more of the same one. Alright, no worries. I mean, I guess it makes sense. I do think it's weird when you go to a temple and you find... Well, I guess not. You find two different languages. I guess it doesn't... It's not super weird. 
Man, look at this. That's pretty sweet looking. Alright guys, I think this is a pretty good spot to go ahead and end the video. After me finally making it past that puzzle. I was worried for a second there. I'm like, wait a minute. I'm super confused. Because I saw the picture and was like, oh, that's what I gotta do. And then she's like, no, it says zero. And I'm like, well, I don't know what zero is. But I guess it makes sense because I'm assuming it's supposed to be year, a year on the side or something. Yeah, thank you guys for stopping by. I appreciate you as always. You're amazing. Thank you for comments and everything for the support. You guys are awesome. Like, I'm so glad that people are enjoying my content. It really makes me happy. Um, I, I'm not sure if I said it before or not. Um, I may have. It's hard to remember with all these videos what I've said and what I haven't said. But if you guys ever want to catch me live stream, um, I stream on Twitch usually on Thursdays and Sundays. Those are my days off. Um, the time isn't super set yet. Thursday it's usually typically easier for me to stream from 1 to 4 um, Eastern time. Uh, just because in the morning I do the recordings for sh um, for the Let's Plays, and then I'm usually making lunch or getting ready for um, getting dinner ready or something like that. Um, but yeah, it's usually a good time for me to stream. I might try and get some night streams in as well, depending on hours at work and whatnot. But yeah, if you guys are ever interested, stop by Twitch. It's the same name, just look up Harad on Twitch, and you'll find me there. Um, and then if I mi if you guys miss any streams, depending on what it is, I'll probably transfer them over here and. Uh, you can check them out. I appreciate anyone that has checked them out. You guys are awesome. Yeah, I hope you have an excellent day. I hope you enjoyed the video. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.